Hi everyone, welcome to Wednesday's Dollar Tree Haul. I hope everybody is doing fantastic since I saw you last in Monday's Dollar Tree Haul. And I have some fun, amazing, excellent finds for you and I'm so excited to show you. But let's start off with the lipstick of the day, which today it is the Hard Candy brand plumping serum and it's called Ooh La La. So this is the lipstick right there but it actually goes on quite clear there is only like a little tinge of color to it but I still like it and it has a really really good fragrance to it I opened it up and I'm like that smells fantastic first of all and when I put this particular one on my lips it definitely you could feel the plumping serum inside of there I had a tingly cold feeling and it really has like a beautiful sparkle to it. So this is my lipstick of the day right here that I wanted to show you guys. I have some amazing things. I cannot wait to show you. So we're just going to go for it. I found this today at the Dollar Tree. And this goes from anywhere between $5 and $10 at its lowest price. This is a universal car mount. And it's multifunction mount for smartphones. Quick release suction mount base so i picked up five of them I picked up one for myself my husband my mom my son and his girlfriend and they were all really really excited by it i looked up the price and that was the lowest cost i could find on it was between five and ten dollars so i was really excited for that this morning i should have probably grabbed several more because um birthdays, Christmas is coming, but I just grabbed them for us in the household and my son's girlfriend and I already gave it to them and they were really, really excited. I'm going to kind of just jump around all over the place to the most amazing things first that I picked up for today's Dollar Tree haul. I found this huge box of fun Fetty cereal and it is a family size and I have never one time ever seen this before but it does say new up in the corner so I could I was so excited my friend Amy messaged me I had been to the Dollar Tree in the morning before work and then she messaged me and was like did you see the fun Fetty cereal so they must have put it on the shelf after I already left in the morning I literally drove like a bat out of you know what and I got there and I picked up six boxes I gave two boxes away and I kept four for my son and this is a gigongous box and fun Fetty we do all the time in cake mix and they are frosting and it's I'm excited for this and my son eats cereal like it's going out of style so there is that right there then I found this right here and this is this brand right here I'm not even gonna try to say it I'm not even gonna try to do it at all and this is the hydration body wash and it says extract complex with coconut oat and honey extracts and it's 32 fluid ounces it, ounces it is a huge bottle and this retails for $18 yes $17.92 is the lowest cost I found for this exact size bottle in this brand in this type of body wash and yes $17.92 for this bottle and there was a whole entire section of these brand new put out on the shelf this morning so I snatched one up and I posted it on my Facebook and already somebody was like I have it it's amazing you should get more so that's what I intend to do hopefully they will have some in the morning because you also can think of that stuff for like uh, baskets if you're making like a spa basket or you're making just a relaxation basket to give to somebody over the holidays for a birthday what have you you could definitely use that in the basket and that is an amazing product to give to somebody that otherwise wouldn't have found it if they don't go to the Dollar Tree all of the time hold on I gotta yell to my husband really quick Richie that's super loud Okay, thank you. I love you. 
he just got home from work. I'm about to go steal time with him after this is over, but he's pumping that TV out in the other room and I didn't want it to boom into my video. So thankfully he just turned it down a little bit. Now here is this right here. This is the Arm & Hammer brand, which I use a ton, a ton, a ton of Arm & Hammer products. I've always loved them the most for like deodorants and you know, body washes and things like that. So I found this right here and this is the essentials with baking soda. This is baby foaming wash and shampoo and it's fragrance free and it's a 12 fluid ounce pump. And I got two of these because I intend on trying it myself. And then I have another one to give away um, to one of my friends that has a small little child. So I found that and I was so excited. Oh, and that retails for like $8. Yeah, this is between like 5 and $8 in the stores. So I looked up that price. Then I found this right here. And this is Family Care Eye Drops Advanced. And someone in my house needed eye drops the other day. So I, I was really paying attention to this in the Dollar Tree and I grabbed it. And then I looked up the brand online and the lowest price I found for these eye drops right here was $5, $4.98 to be exact. And it says child safety cap on it. So I picked that up and now we got eye drops. So voila and right here this is the beverly hills polo cub <laughs> no it's not a polo cub it's not a bear it's a beverly hills polo club blue it says it says soothing after shave shave balm and this goes for ten dollars nine dollars and 98 cents is what i found it for online pricing and in this exact size tube, this is a 2.5 fluid ounce little tube right here. And um, this is $9.98. That's what I found the price for. And I guess it has really good reviews. So this is the stuff I'm telling you. We're, we're rounding the corner here. We're in August now. Before we know it, it's going to be the holidays. It's going to be like ready, set, go, get your, your odds and ends together for this one and that one. So when you see things like this, maybe you don't need it yourself personally, but go with a list of things that are coming up and the people that you would normally shop for. And you could include that girl, include that girl, guy, whoever is on here chilling with me. Hi guys. Um, and then I found this rubber made and this is just a, just one, but it is a take along. It's meal prep, um, built in dividers to keep food separated. So I found this and the dividers, uh, I'm trying to get a clear picture, but it's like a big section here and then two divided sections right there, uh, so that you can keep all of your items and food, little meal all separated and I actually like that because I'm not one to like keep things all mishmashed all over my plate I kind of like to keep my plates neat and tidy so I got this one so that I could pack lunches and what have you and um just have it all ready for me to open up and eat up now let's oh wait hold up wait a minute I found this right here again in the Ioni brand, which is the brand that keeps coming out with a bunch of eyelashes for, for since the Ioni brand started, you know, being at the Dollar Tree, they always did the lashes and the lash glue, but this is like their whole line of makeup that has come out now. And this is comfort long lasting matte finish lipstick. And it's Berry Jam, the name of it. So I have added another lipstick to my stash and I'm not mad about it. And that color looks absolutely beautiful. And what a pretty little, like the packaging on these Ioni things that I shared on my Instagram to show you guys a picture of the whole wall. Again, here we are in the Instagram. Um, little announcement, if you want to follow me over on my Instagram, 
It's Crazy Days of Callan. I post a lot of stuff over there. I've really gotten into the swing of things on Instagram and I'm using it a lot these days to update things for the Dollar Tree hauls um, to just to just interact with you guys a little bit more outside of YouTube. So if you want to follow me there, be my guest. Um, so I can't wait to try that lipstick and I'm wicked excited about it. Now, I did grab some more of my favorite wipes that have come out from Bolero. If you've been with me for a while, you know I don't like the Bolero line at the Dollar Tree. I don't like almost any of their products, um, and I don't like the spa descriptions either. Products that have come out at the Dollar Tree, but for some reason, the Bolero wipes for the face are fantastic. But they're not all fantastic. I found this line probably like three or four months ago and I hauled the entire line and every single one of the wipes that were in this type of packaging and they have like eight or nine different um, scents and stuff like that were fantastic. I don't like a lot of the other ones that have come out. I try them and I don't even bother because they really, really, they don't have a good moisture to them. They don't have the scent that they're claiming to have. But this line right here is was fantastic and they were my favorite wipes. So I found one lonely package and I did pick it up again. It's coconut moisturizing facial wipes with eucalyptus and there's a 32 count in there and they the packages were beautiful altogether too when I hauled them months ago. They were every color of the rainbow and they had like this design on them in different patterns and stuff and they were really really cool scents and they all were accurate to what they were claiming to be which I really appreciate. Now let's get into some more fall stuff because I have found quite a few other things here. Now I found packages of these pumpkin picks here and there is another size i got the really big ones which is a four count in there and then i got the really small ones which is a 10 count of these picks so i am intend to craft with these take them off the pick leave some on the pick and do some crafting with them once halloween kicks in and so the same thing for these guys right here. And then they also had a medium size, which came in a five count. So I was wicked excited about that. Then I saw these beautiful fall picks right here. And I was like, wow, those are really, really, really pretty. Look at those. Those are stunning. There's three pieces um, to four pieces on like each pick right here. And they are just absolutely beautiful. Look at that pumpkin and the flower mixture. And then look at this one. This one has to be my favorite because it's so different. It has like one leaf, but I love that. I just love it. I think it's absolutely beautiful. And then this one right here with the gourd and the sunflower. And so I am probably going to do like a little... A little arrangement for my table and stick these out of it for the fall they are absolutely beautiful but they had so many different ones to choose from that I was standing there and I was almost feeling overwhelmed trying to pick all of the different ones so those three struck me right off the bat and those are the ones that I grabbed I probably will see them hopefully again and I'll pick through them a little bit more to see if there's any other ones I want to grab and pick up but those were definitely my three favorites, so I grabbed those. Now, I found this right here, and I think that these are so pretty. And there's 36 pieces in here of these berries, but they did have them in a bunch of other colors. They had some darker ones. They had some, um, they had, I, I think that they had some, like, reddish looking ones, but I loved these the most because they're kind of mixed with the yellow and orange and a little bit of, like, a, like a burnt looking orangey red. And so those are really pretty to put in the arrangements and stuff that I intend on making for Halloween and for, you know, fall and Thanksgiving and things like that. Then I found a whole entire string light section and these are LED lights for indoor use only and they're white LEDs but they have the pumpkins. Um, they have the pumpkin ones which I did not pick up. 
Girl, I just took these all the way out, girl. So, so I got the maple leaves and I intend on giving these to my mom and that the lights right here, they're all maple leaves and I think that they're so pretty. So when the white light shines through them, that's where the battery pack is. And then this would all get untangled and stretch across. And so there's 10 maple leaves in there. And I can just, I'm going to give this to my mom so that she likes to always keep up like twinkle lights and everything up in her room. So she can put it like along her bureau and light up her little maple leaf led lights but they had them in pumpkins i think they had a couple of different types of pumpkin options on the picks uh, not on the picks on the led string lights but i love the maple leaves because i know she loves maple leaves so much so i grabbed those for her and i have like tons of batteries so she can just grab whatever battery she needs and then I found these garland right here, these fall foliage garland. Oh my goodness. I love these every single time that they come out every year with all the different mixture of leaves all over it. I string these along my porch banister for, you know, for the fall and, and everything. And I just love the different variation of them that come out again on my Instagram. I've put up like a ton of pictures every single time that I see something that's like too good to pass up sharing with you guys. I'll snap a quick picture, put it on my Instagram, or if it's something that I think is a really good product, but I don't particularly need it myself and I'm not going to purchase it to haul for you guys, I'll take pictures and throw them on my Instagram so that you can still see what's in the store just in case anybody does need those items. Um, I'm just not going to buy things and waste a dollar if they're not things that I'm definitely going to use or need or give away to people that I love. So here is another one of the fall garland and I, my store had a whole entire wall display and there were so many leaf um, options with different colors for fall on it. Some of them had little, little additions of things. This is like a little acorn that came on it with some berries. They all had like little different things sprinkled throughout them. And then I got this one right here, which is a darker burnt leaf looking. And then it has a little gourd and the little berries through it. So like I'll twirl it around my my mailbox. I put it all along my banister. Right now I have the ivy leaves all strung through my porch, all cascading down. Everybody's like, is that real? Is that growing on your porch? Because almost from a distance when people are going by my house, they think that it's real, but it looks so pretty. And it's, the, you know, from the garland options for ivy and it just looks so pretty. So then I found another one of these right here and these are decorative card stocks just like I found in the Halloween option the other day. Again, I still haven't looked up exactly what this is, but I absolutely love all of the little characters and things like that on there. This is them. I just, I'm really, really, really into foxes. When we went up to Pittsburgh, New Hampshire, which we go up there as often as possible, but we had a lot of interactions with foxes and I, I have, I did vlogs and stuff like that of our P Pittsburgh, New Hampshire, um, adventures and stays and things like that. But we did see a lot of different fox going about the, you know, the area and I've become like, I just love them. I think they're beautiful. And so I saw the fox and I just had to have it. And again, I don't know what this decorative card stock is just yet, but I'll figure it out and I'll certainly use it because I will cut out those pieces and purpose them quick, quick, quick. Yes, I will. And then I found these stickers right here and I had to grab them because when I'm sending out happy mail, friend mail to my friends, I want to make it beautiful and of course you know I'm an ocean girl I love mermaids I love bright beautiful colors and I love all of the little sea life all throughout 
this entire sticker sheet right here and the mermaids but that's me right there that looks like me down there in the corner with the glasses and the ponytail and um this is a 50 count of stickers right there so i had to pick that up and i was really excited to grab that now i found these right here and how cute is this honest to goodness to give you know for to a child to a baby we all who did not have their parents at some point trying to get the baby to open their mouth to take some food when they really weren't feeling it and then mom and dad come or grandma and grandpa, nana and pa, all of my people used to be like, mm, here comes the airplane and then they do the and then open your mouth and you would eat it. Well, they came out with a blue and a pink option for airplane spoons in the boot and the baby not the booby section what is happening with my like i i don't know i don't know it's not the booby section it is the baby section um it's a long day it's a long day guys it's a long day so i saw these and i thought how cute is that that is just like how a amazing that they came up with this concept and actually you know made it into actual spoons i love them so much so i had to grab them because the minute i saw them i thought wow that is the coolest i don't have to pretend anymore you know when i have grandchildren someday or i have you know some little person in my life that i'm trying to feed and i'm i have an imaginary airplane coming at their face well now i have a real one so that they will eat and not give me a hard time <laughs> so then i also found these right here and these were in the toy section and this is a doll bath play set and i again i'm all about it i love baths this just i love baths i love water i love showers i just need to be in it and I love, love taking a bath. So when I saw this, I just needed to grab it. It comes with the whole little faucet set up and then a little spray, you know, a little thing to spray. If you, I don't think it actually sprays though. A rubber ducky and some play soap. Put your Barbies in there and give her a good scrub down. Your babies, your baby alive. I don't know what's going to fit in here, but I think that this is terribly cute. I really do. So I got one in a pink and in a blue because that's just too cute for words. And I, I couldn't leave it there. It was the cutest thing I've ever seen. Now, I had just been telling you when I keep showing you that I'm hauling like Dr. Seuss items and stuff like that. I keep telling you I've never seen like books of Dr. Seuss at the Dollar Tree. I find all of the Dr. Seuss things in the teaching tree section that I've been hauling, but I've never actually seen, you know, I've never actually seen like books or coloring books and stuff like that. Then I go to the Dollar Tree and look at what I found. I found a color activity book of Dr. Seuss to add to my gift set for Dr. Seuss items. So I very much appreciate that and I'm really excited about it. So I grabbed this one. I grabbed that one. And I think that they have like four or five options, but I picked these three up right here to add to my Dr. Seuss little gift set that I'm building up with Dr. Seuss items from the Dollar Tree and that like Dollar Tree thank you thank you thank you thank you for gifts and for all the presents in the world that I have given out for all of these years you have done me real well with saving money and I appreciate you Dollar Tree if you ever watch this then I found puzzles and they had an entire section of brand new put out on the shelf bright and early in the morning puzzles and they were all Dr. Seuss puzzles and I was like what is going on so here's 24 piece Horton here's a who puzzle and you know I love puzzles my well I don't love doing puzzles certainly I do not because my husband does them for me and he frames them with the 11 by 14 frames from the Dollar Tree 
and he has made me so many beautiful puzzles and framed them and I have displayed them and they're quite beautiful at some point. I will have to take a picture once he's all puzzled out and they're all displayed and share it with you on my Instagram. Now we're getting toward the end here, but I do want to show you that I got another little gem here of 250 pieces of beads to make bracelets, necklaces, like, you know, get your kids into crafting. If, you know, just, it's a fun day. Get involved with them. Sit at the table. There's so many crafting options in the crafter's square section. You can have, I used to, once paint night became really popular, you know, to go out and sip wine and paint on on easels and stuff like that on canvases and that became like a really big trendy thing to go out and do the dollar tree instantly came out with canvases and then i was like i ain't paying 35 45 dollars to go sit in a room full of strangers to paint on a canvas and sip wine because i don't even like it and i'm gonna go to the dollar tree and get all of the things that i need the canvases the paint brushes the paint and they even have smocks sometimes, um, not always in adult sizes, more for the kids. And make a whole entire night of it at my house because that's more my speed. And then for the jewelry, the same thing. They, I started making jewelry and then all of a sudden Crafters Square started coming out with all of these really, really cute options for jewelry making, beads and all kinds of stuff and I just it's amazing for a dollar it really is because you could go to Hobby Lobby and find plastic beads to make some bracelets and they're going to be more than a dollar I promise you that so here's 250 count of beads and I would have fun hanging out with one of my little chicks that I love so much in my life and making jewelry with them all day if that's what they want to do and I found this right here and this is glow in the dark beads and there's a hundred pieces in here and how much fun would this be to have like if you're having like a little Halloween function or something like that around Halloween time to make this into a crafting table at your Halloween party and have the kids sit down with some elastic you know options for putting the beads on and making little glow in the dark bracelets for Halloween and these are really going to come in handy at Halloween time at my house because we are all about it and I love it so much now the last few things are food and I know a lot of people don't really get into like the food hauling from the Dollar Tree but I'm still going to show you anyways because it's a good deal these Lay's stacks are great I like them way better than there it is. That hasn't happened in a while, but I just almost hit myself in the face. So that's where we're going at the end of this video. Um, I like these better than the Pringles. I like them better than Pringles. My whole family likes the lace stacks better than Pringles, but the guys needed some like little chips to put in some Ziploc bags for their lunch. And so I grabbed the sour cream and onion. I grabbed the cheddar. And I also grabbed the Mesquite Barbecue, which is one of their favorites. So there are their chips that they can separate into their Ziploc baggies and put in their lunch. Then I found these right here. And these are Pampa brand banana pepper rings in their suite. And my husband is going to be super excited because he loves banana peppers. And this is the first time ever that I have ever seen them at the Dollar Tree. So I picked it up and it's a really decent little size jar. And if he likes them, I will run back and I will grab them. I will grab them some more. Sorry, I hit the camera. And then bullseye, bullseye everyday barbecue sauce, honey. They have bullseye barbecue sauce. This is like two, three dollars in the grocery store. Um, more toward the three dollar range. So I grab the honey and the bullseye and then the craft right here which is sweet brown sugar put this over some chicken breast and bake it in the oven girl and this tastes amazing or get some chicken wings and dump this in there and let them like sit overnight in the fridge and then cook them 
good times. All right, so that's it. Happy Wednesday, Dollar Tree haul. I love you guys so much. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for hanging out with me. I hope you guys have a wonderful, blessed, amazing, happy, healthy, fantastic, wonderful. Always be kind to one another couple of days. I will see you in Saturday's Dollar Tree haul. Please like, share, subscribe, definitely comment down below and hit that bell notification so that you are aware of every single time I give you a new video of any kind. I think the world of you. Thank you so much for always supporting me, being here, and I think you guys are beautiful people. So that's it, and I will see you Saturday. Love, blessed, amazingness the rest of your days of this week. Bye, guys. Love you so much.